Hi, I'm Robert Jacobson. I'm a physician here at Mayo Clinic and I'm head of our medical director of the Employee Community Health Immunization Program as well as the Southeast Minnesota Region Immunization Program. I'm here to talk about National Immunization Awareness Month. Parents have uh, expressed concerns with uh, the number of vaccines that we vaccinate. And while we clinicians are excited about what we can do in terms of uh, preventing disease, parents are dismayed when they hear the number of needles and when they hear about the number of things we're covering as though perhaps it might be too much. In fact, um, these vaccines have been studied for safety and e efficacy given together just the way they are at the times that they are. So we have studies of literally tens of thousands of children uh, getting the vaccine with and without the new vaccine in that schedule at that time, demonstrating both safety and efficacy. Moreover, it turns out that these doses of antigen, if you will, proteins that stimulate immunity, are, are really microscopic compared to what the baby uh, is built to handle. In fact, the, the baby is uh, getting exposed to far more immunogenic material, antigens, proteins that stimulate immunity at birth with the first feeding than they are with any one of these vaccination dates. Uh, in fact, in the old days when we were giving the whole cell pertussis vaccine, uh, we were giving in that single dose 250 antigens. Um, and with the uh, smallpox vaccine that we were giving for much of the last century to infants, we were actually giving even twice that amount of antigens in a single vaccine. We've dramatically actually, we've dramatically reduced the amount of antigen we're giving with our vaccines uh, in comparison to what we used to be doing. And it pales in comparison to the antigens that the baby can tolerate and the baby actually does see even with the first feedings. It said that a trip to daycare on any given day exposes a baby to two to nine more antigens. Um, so we shouldn't fear the uh, idea of uh, vaccinating against several things at once. We have good evidence it doesn't hurt uh, and that it does help.